know, at the rock. All right, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. I hope you're doing fine. So today we're gonna have a look at another Life of a Hunter gameplay. And it is quite an interesting one because I do not play some sweaty long ammo. I'm actually playing something else. So let's have a look at the loadout. We're gonna play the Science Vitaly, which I absolutely love lately, together with our packs. The packs mostly just for, you know, to get more ammo. Although the Vettel is doing pretty fine on its own regarding ammo pool, so you can swap the packs for something else. Maybe a saber or a hand crossbow. Up to you. Now, we have a Vettel silenced, the packs secondary. Then I play with the dusters, the med kit, the decoy fuses, and the concertina trip mine. I'm a huge fan of the regular knife, but the hellhounds they just die to the science Vettel anyway, so I need something to kill. Exactly, immolators. In immolators, they die the fastest to the knuckles, so I take these. Mad kit is a no-brainer. Decoy fuses are pretty nice. I don't need the throwing knives because, well, I'm playing a silence gun. <sighs> it's so nice. You think somebody is camping in a building? Toss a decoy in there, see if they move. If they push you aggressively, toss a decoy, maybe they fall back. So, insane value. Also, you can resupply them quite easily if you take decoy supply for one point. Then, Concertina trip mine, honestly, up to you. They're very expensive, and without Frontiers Man, you have only two charges. I like to use them to secure kills, or to make it a little bit more difficult for the enemy team to revive their teammates. So, you sneak up to the body that you just killed, place a trip mine, trigger the trip mine maybe yourself, or, you know, as a necro counterplay, let them necro them, and then trigger the Concertina trip mine themselves. Consumable, pretty straightforward to be honest. One big vitality shot, as long as you don't have Doctor, you this is a must-have in my opinion. One frag bomb because frag bombs are pretty awesome. And then honestly, whatever you like. Sometimes I bring a hellfire bomb, I bring maybe a normal fire bomb since they burn out for two minutes, and then sometimes I bring a concertina bomb. You can also take big stamina shots or you know, whatever. The more important points, or the most important Consumables, definitely with shot and one explosive in my opinion. The rest is up to you. All right, that's it. Um, traits that you should get, Doctor and Pack Mule, the first two traits, and then whatever you like. Lots of people were most likely by fanning with this loadout. So you get some close quarter value. Honestly, I didn't pick fanning. And throughout the whole life of this hunter, I did not miss it. It's a little bit mad because... Pushing buildings with this loadout is a huge pain in the ass without fanning, but dual wielding, fanning and levering, I'm not a huge fan of that anymore, because oh, they're just so unreliable, and they made me flip a table once or twice the last couple days. So here we go, enjoy the gameplay. That's fine. Okay, never mind. Another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host.
right in the back. Sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mr. Sparks. Science have a five velocity, though. that's cool. Betterly feels really good, even without Iron Sharp Shooter. Yeah, that's true. Okay, cool. I respect that. Oh, for fuck's sake. Doesn't matter too much since we made already some noise. Good. Take it for the meme. I like the pen. Second. Yeah, I'm going this way because all the supply points are here. And I want them. Killing the meathead would be better, yeah. Then you get shot, then you cannot swap guns. That's fine. That's why I bring the packs. I have lots of spare ammo then. That's cool. Ah, shit. So you could already see in the first clip some value regarding the concertina trip mine. You can rotate a little bit easier than you will hear when they try to break the wire so that it gives you a little bit of time to come back to counter the revive. Alright, so there was a really, really long match because I knew where the boss was, but I decided not to go there due to my loadout. So I was collecting more butcher clues. And then at one moment, somebody finally decided to banish the assassin. So I decided to go over there and, well, let's see um, what we face there. We face big guns and small rats. Right. What hunter are you playing? They're reptilian. <laughs> you want to talk worthless? Let's talk about conduit. But even conduit is not worthless because if you get shot mid-fight with bounty carriers, you kill one, you loot it, you get health. That can be clutch. But yeah. I think the most useless trait is actually uh, I mean the seeming dark side. I don't know. Decoy supply, no. Decoy supply is good. Why are they not leaving the fucking boss now? <laughs> decoy supply works with decoy fuses. Yeah, that's why I'm buying it. It refills all of them. Which is pretty good, you go to an ammo box, you refill your decoy fuses, and then you get something back that's more valuable from your toolbox. No, there's... Why did that first bullet not... It's fucking nitro, that's why nobody's here. That's very fun. I am in uh, one shot kill range. Wait, what? Say what? Interesting. Interesting. Dauntless is useless. Dauntless is probably the best one point perk in the game. 
boy, I, I know exactly why I don't want to finish my fucking trade guides. What the fuck was that? There was a derringer somewhere over there. I hate you all gats. I swear. I always started the fucking guide regarding the traits. Or regarding our tier system for the traits. And midway I'm like, now nah, you know what? This is the fucking comment section on YouTube, this is not worth it. Bitch is shooting me while I deal with the fuck. I hate you. Yeah, now he's rest because I missed my concertina thanks to the aim punch. Are oh, you fucking red? Are oh, you little piece of. I don't know. Alright, fuck the bounty carriers. Fuck the bounty carriers. Hey! Hey, you guys inside. Can I help you against the people northwest and you're not shooting me in the back? Is that a deal? So, sorry for the headshot there, but they pissed me off just now. So I would like to kill them and you can leave. Is that a deal? Okay, maybe not. Alright. Good talk. Yo, fuck these guys, man. I want the other one. Fucking shot me. Stupid son of bitches. They don't peek the whole time, although they know where I am. Then they see me push after I kill somebody, and he's shooting with his fuck gun. Aw, oh, you little... Oh, I know that's personal now, dude. That's fucking personal now. It's fucking personal now, dude. You son of... Yeah, yeah, yeah. What was that? Yo, fuck's sake, man. Is this a shadow? And watch the shadow shoot me. Hey, the fuck? There was a VoIP icon. Yep, because I'm sitting in front of it. It's a shame that they changed that. Because now you don't see it when I use it. You're always mad about aim punch? Because it's happening at the worst time ever. Exclusively. <laughs> we also have beer is good, NA. I love you, dude. I hope you get one for Friday night and you can relax for your weekend. I'm really tempted to just fucking... Charge them with the knuckles. Alright, why, why did you shoot me? When I tried to concertina bomb them, huh? That was not fucking nice. Just close the fucking door again. Another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host.
he's burning. Yeah, it's not showing the trap. It's there. And next time, you don't interrupt me. GG, boy. GG. Alright, so we settled this. The bounty is probably gone now. Are you? Are you? Are you? Mm. <sighs> well, I promised them I let them leave. It's okay. Romero equals pistol, got it, Mike. Wait, he, he was asking regarding a science gun, right? Weapon, not pistol. Or was it a pistol? Shit, if it was a pistol, then... Honestly, I don't... I don't care. Is that a pistol? Well, then, dodge. Is that a pistol? Fuck yeah, dude. Science dodge. 950 bucks. Just to fuck with all the Dolch Winers. Make it the first throw of April. April 1st, full or something like that. There was a decent round though. There was really a decent round. I mean, yeah, not a lot of killing, but still, it was a long match, right? That felt forever. From Fort Bolden, collecting all the clues, then to Ash Creek, back to the bounty, having some fights over there, going up Pearl Plantation. There was definitely 25 minutes or something like that. Body could be. A long one though. Uh five stars to four stars. Okay. Alright. Oh. Holy shit. Why was that so long? Well, it took a long time for the banish to happen. So in the next one it's rather filthy, I have to say. I like to go for a lot of wall banks, and most of them are purely, you know, shooting by sound. The sound design in Hunt Children is probably one of the best in gaming history. And sometimes you just, you know, you miss all the shots that you don't take. Sometimes you take some random shots, and well, sometimes you just get reported, I guess. Also, since I don't have a close range loadout, it's nice to see in this gameplay clip how important it is to fall back and to decide when is the right moment to engage. Hello. Oh, he turned to the side and it made me almost miss. But only almost, so get ready. Almost missed. Yo, he turned to the side though without any fucking reason. So yeah, I almost missed there. Yeah, you better fucking run. No. Is 
It's an extract. Yup. I'm not super happy with what I have, but okay. Not defending the boss layer either. Northeast. Male hunter. Another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host. Now don't tell me there's one up here. They killed the Immo. That was at me. Okay, let's rotate the other way. I mean, I'm easy to spot up there. If I would have died up there by a sniper, I would have just said, yep. You know what? That's acceptable. So far, I didn't hear a shotgun though, so I heard one Winnie. And something else, but I didn't pay attention. There's an uppercut. Oh, hello. <coughs> we might have a look at that. Yeah, Kenji, I see your pop up. the rock <laughs> okay I'm reported for that one you could see one of the you could see one of the bees stick out of the wall and I shot that you, you could see one of the bees flying outside, and I shot that. I, uh... Yeah, okay. The bees have a radius of 2 meters, Mike. That's why I'm so surprised that I actually hit that. Then there was one on this rock. They will think she died to the fucking bees, which is slightly hilarious. Mm, I don't wanna kill that. I really didn't want to kill that. Oh shit, man. Did I see something there? Or was it a fucking shadow? Most of them are shooting from here. Oh, they're using flash bombs. So I guess they pushed to the lair already.
I have to lead so much. She knows the where I am. And uh, they are coming for me. They, they're gonna hold W hard. Are they leaving with one token? No. Oh wait. No, that was spider just now. Okay. There you go. Do I have enough time to get the ammo or will they just fucking bail if I grab the ammo? Hmm no. They're not going to that extraction, or not yet. I think I have enough time to get some ammo. They might see me though over here and might say, no, you know what, they're actually like... Do they want me that hard? If they turn around and extract, then I'm fucked, that's why. Right there. Postal delivery. They really want me, dude. I'm dealing no damage there. She has a shotgun. How hard do they want me? Okay, I don't think they want me anymore. I think one of them has a sniper though. Yeah, they're running back. Yeah. Still okay. I prefer this. I'm getting fucking owned there. I also have to be careful now because... Yep. I don't think they're extracting. They're not. Okay. Let's see if I can set up something in the in the mountains. Oh, you fucked up. Necro?
he somehow gets to revive, I want to beat Hera at one bar. Oh, fuck yeah, baby. <laughs> yes, that was nice. That was nice. All right, all right. I dig that. I dig that. I fucking dig that. Yo, how many weapons did you pick up to end up with this? She had a shotgun earlier, so she decided to go... Okay, that's the fucking armor. I'm like, wait, what? Really have to lead those shots? Yup. <laughs> just got a steam notification. You just killed me! <laughs> yes. Got the other bounties. Oh dear. Hello? Yeah, they burned her. She got killed by me. <laughs> Um, she's not happy about that. Oh. Another mind breaks and joins the psychotic host. That bounty isn't moving, right? Why is that bounty not moving? No, it is moving. Yeah, yeah, okay. They're not dead. They're running down. But that's fine. I need some supplies. And I got an uppercut. Ah. I'm gonna do the smart thing. I'm gonna call this a G fucking G. So it's been a while since I played that hunter and now he returns during the Halloween event. And what's more scary than running around with a silencer, bopping people in the head and they don't know from where. Not much actually. So let's see how this round went. Pay your taxes on it, that's your part of the charity event. Oh, it's here. I had different plans for that. Oh, it's not here, it's just my third clue. Holy fuck, man, I'm still not myself after the last two matches. Ever been to Salzburg? Multiple times. My grandma likes to go to Salzburg, so I take her there sometimes. Austria and Germany are fucking awesome. Well, they have their own little problems, but compared to other countries in the world, I think, uh, yeah, living in Austria and Germany, there are not a lot of countries where it's better. Stop bragging, Mike! Okay. That was mine. Okay. Alright. Some work needs to be done. Alright. Awesome. These people will probably come down here. Switzerland? Wow, Switzerland is fucking expensive. So you have to work there to, you know, live there too. I mean, it makes sense. Most of the people do that anyway, but... No, Switzerland is pretty great too. I want to rotate to the other side. Can you go in here? No. I think those are just birds or hentai noodles. Yeah. Let's go over. 
Sometimes, I swear to God, ducks and the hentai noodles, they sound like footsteps for me. Same with some window shutters, dude. Crazy. Oh, you worked and live like a king in Germany and Austria. Yeah, that works too. I'm gonna use my mines at the extraction. Well, I'm not the only one setting up here. There's a dude here. And he's not moving anymore. Well, I wasn't wrong. Cheeky little bugger. I only hurt her. Solo? How many pickups do you want, Mike? Yes, all of them, please. They're going north, this is fine. They're still sitting there, okay. She's still down. I don't want to waste my health on her. I mean, they see me in dark side. Not moving. Alright, let's rotate a little bit. Uh, in this case, I'm gonna do this. a fucking solo. That would have been wild, though. Trip mindset extract. Yeah. Of course, dude. Solo life has no rules, man. Like, absolutely no rules in solo play. So, but... Okay, the other one's just fucking extracted. That means, though, that there's more people, because no way a fucking trio is afraid of a sign steadily. So I have to be careful and just rushed in there. Because if I rush in there, I fucking die. Is there any gentleman rule for solo play? No. There are no gentleman rules. You join the bio, you fight to the death. Maybe some diplomacy, and that's it. Maybe some people look down on you because you set people on fire, but honestly, with all the changes that they did, burning is totally fine. Says the guy who got fucking insta-burned, I don't know. 
20 times yesterday. Hey there! Are there more people? Or am I alone? I guess there's one more. Has to be AI, right? <gasps> hmm. Maybe a leech? The shot was from over there, though, so that fits. Fuck that shit now. <laughs> A grunt died behind me though. I'm gonna check on that solo. Fuck. I swear, dude! What's going on, man? Fucking rats everywhere. In the bushes, man. On the fucking rocks. In the water. Like... Wait, what? And who's that? You could see the fucking hair sticking out of the bush. I know my bushes, man. He probably didn't even see me though. <laughs> okay, where the fuck did I kill him? All oh, right there. I'm sorry, what? It looks like you <clears throat> played something very expensive. Okay, that is worth it. Are they leaving north? No. Okay, how many more solos do I find? And that was not the guy shooting at me. Steal it? Why? Okay, so there's another team right there. In that barn, most likely. And somebody actually did die to that alert trip mine. Which is giving me a nice little Lula moment, to be honest. <laughs> there you are. <sighs> the 
distance. You fucking what, mate? Huh? You... I see. I see. Okay. <gasps> Who? ah! Who's that? Oh, that's probably the third one from their team. Right? I want to see this. Wow, they are so sneaky. Is it? Or is it another solo? That's the teammate from the first one? That is the teammate from the first one? What in the actual fuck? What are you doing? Oh no! Wait, wait, what? Wait, 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 I don't understand. No, no, no. It has the teammate outline. There has to be the teammate. He faked revive to bait shot? Fake? Maybe. What the fuck, dude? What? Okay, this is... This is... Okay. Uh, that's not a new player either, I tell you that. What the actual fuck? Okay. Alright, GG. Yo, man, some people bring a lot of patience to the fucking table. Insane. Oh, you fuck. Okay, never mind. <laughs> right in the back. Sweet. And next time, you don't interrupt me. GG, boy. GG. Oh, at the rock. Oh, you fucked up. Baby! Well, I wasn't wrong. I swear, dude! What's going on, man? Fucking rats everywhere. And that was a bit of a longer run with the Reptilian. Hope you liked the stealth gameplay. I might go back to some crossbow action. That was always lots of fun and I buffed the crossbow quite a bit. So let's see.
People who are awesome can be seen here, my patrons. The next video has the updated wall, so check that out and let me know if there's something wrong. Thank you for watching, Science Vatterly is just fun and a great warm-up weapon. I see you in the next one. Until then, have a good day and bye-bye.